Good morning. Welcome to the Inspirational Prayer Network. I am your host, Apostle Nabs. How are you this morning? Oh, we just about approaching 2016. And you know, there's a song that ran through my mind and some of you all are the old some I have we have some old people, old school people and you probably remember this song, but it kind of goes like this. Down through the years, God's been good to me. Down through the years, God's been good to me. Down through the years, God's been good to me. He's been good. He's been good. He's been good. That song just, I don't know, as I was going to do the show, that song just got into my spirit. And I'm like, oh my God. Because truly, down through 2015, it wasn't the best year, but it wasn't the worst year, if that makes any sense. A lot of things, me personally, I was able to get accomplished. Um, a lot of things... I allow my personal life to get involved in it. It threw things off and everything. But once again, God is faithful. And I just want to encourage you, you know, to think about what the book of Philippians says. And I, I don't have the chapter with me, but it's the book of Philippians where it says, forget in those things which are behind you. And pressing on towards your mark of a high calling. And I decree blessings upon each and every one of you all. And I just want to take the time out to say thank you for listening to the show. Thank you for even going on the um, fan page on Facebook. I want to say thank you because... God is good. God is so merciful. God is so wonderful. He's so kind. And I just want to say thank you all so very much. And as we get ready to make this shift, none of us know what the outcome is going to be. None of us know what 2006 is going to bring. Now for me, and it's so funny, I always get my blessings in two thousand in the odd number. I mean excuse me in the even numbers. I don't know if some people get their blessings some people get blessings in odd years. Some people get blessings in even years. Me, I mostly get my most blessings in even years. And so I, I'm I'm excited about this the new year coming in. I have shut down. I was sharing with my ex-husband this morning. He came by and I'm, I told him, I said, look, if you can't get a hold to me, I'm fine. But I'm, I'm shutting down. So he kind of made a joke. He said, you ain't pay the phone bill, have you? I said, no, phone bill is paid. That, that, the phone bill is paid. That ain't a problem. It's that I'm spending this time with myself. But not only that, tomorrow is my birthday. I will not tell my age. A lot of people, they, they, it's so funny, a lot of people tell me, they say, you look like you're in your 30s. Some people tell me you look like you're in your 40s. But I let that be a mystery. But I am young. I am I am young. I had my children. Well, at the age of 17 years old, I got married. And I had my children early. And I thank God because now I'm free to roam around the country. You know, that, that the commercial to be on uh, the airlines, Southwest. I think it's South, Southwest. But... Right now, I have no ties. Um, my mother, I take care of her, and which I enjoy taking care of her. I mean, you know, it's, sometimes it gets very challenging, and it gets very, oh my goodness, it, it can be very, very challenging, but I enjoy doing it and everything. So, you know, I just thank God. I just praise God. I thank God for my family. I, I got a letter from my husband earlier this morning. And he was sharing with me how God was doing some things in, in Africa. And it's like, yes, yes. I couldn't even go to sleep. I was so, oh my God. I was so energized. I'm like, say yes, yes, yes. And everything. So, so you know, I, I'm just, I'm just, 
Oh, I'm just breathing in, breathing in, breathing in, and everything. So, but you know, I just want to thank God. I just want to thank God for His many blessings. I just want to thank God for Him because God is good. And I just want to, as we get ready to close out, this will be the last show for 2015. And I personally want to say thank you, SoundCloud. Thank you, YouTube. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. That's all I can say. Thank you. And everything. So let us go into prayer. Father God, we thank you, Lord, for your many blessings. We praise you, God, for the things that you're doing in our lives. Father God, we exalt your name on high because above all the earth, you will be exalted. Father God, as we get ready to go into 2016, Father God, I decree and I declare supernatural blessings on the people of God. Father God, I declare it right now in the name of Jesus. Oh God, move the negative stuff out and bring in the positive. Because you declared in your word that our mouths have our mouths have life and death in our tongue. You said in your word. It, it didn't take Buddha. It didn't take Islam. It didn't take none of those people to tell us. You said it in your word. Death and life is in the power of the tongue. And Father God, I speak of life. And to the people right now, I speak it right now in the name of Jesus. I declare it right now that 2016 will be a supernatural year for the people of God. Oh God, we thank you, Lord. We thank you, God. We thank you. Father God, I thank you for even allowing me to see another year of my birthday, God. I say thank you. Father God, I thank you for allowing me to see that my family circle has not been broken. I say thank you. I say thank you, sweet Jesus. Thank you. Father God, remember my husband. Remember all the husbands, Father. Not just mine, but all the husbands. Father God, we thank you for their strength. That they protect their families. We thank you for the wives, God. We thank you, Father, for the mothers, God. We thank you, God. And we praise you, God. Oh, God, and even for the babies, Jesus, we thank you for the children. Oh, God, Father God, this last year, 2015, was hell for these children. Father God, I ask God that you bless them with peace. Protect them, Father God. Protect them. Father God, remember President Obama, God. And this whole election junk that's going on. Father God, we ask God that you move in the mighty name of Jesus. Father God, we ask that you move, God. We ask that you move. Father God, although the negative stuff has been said by President Obama, Father God, I want to say thank you for him. I want to say thank you. Thank you for Michelle, God. I want to say thank you. Thank you for his children. I want to say thank you. Father God, whoever the next president may be, if it's Trump, Carson, whoever it may be, Father God, we ask God that you pull down that, that pride of these guys. And God, you pull it down, God, that you be God. That you be God. That's all I ask God. You be God. Yes, the people might put them in, in leadership, but God, you're the one that has the last say. And Father God, I thank you. Now, Father, bless the inspiration of prayer network. And Father, forgive me for allowing my personal feelings to get in the way with this thing. Forgive me, God. I ask that you bless it, God. In the mighty name of Jesus, we thank you and we give you all the glory and all the honor for in your name we pray. Amen. Like I say, guys, I just, oh my God, I feel good about this. I really feel good. Um, I, um, I, I want to say that we, right now, we are ranking 800 and something listeners on, this, on, on, on the Inspirational Prayer Network. And I want to say thank you. I want to talk about it on Facebook, but you know I'm learning some things. You got you have a lot of jealousy people. 
on Facebook and you know people they 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 oh my god it's just crazy but I just want to say thank you for listening thank you for being there for me thank you for praying for me you know thank you because without your prayers I could not succeed in the things that I'm trying to get done and I want to say thank you and I want to say I promise next year it's going to be better I'm, I'm learning how to organize myself <laughs> I'm learning how to organize myself and everything I love you all so much oh and I want to say this I want to do I want to do like a little memorial right here because a lot of you all did not know I had two Facebook pages and about a month and a half ago the Lord spoke to me and the Lord said shut it down but before I shut it down there was one little lady she was an elderly lady I noticed when I make comments she never did make no comments and you know I never did hear anything I said let me check my inbox to see I've been knowing this lady for a long time well I happened to go on her Facebook page because I wanted to see what was going on and little did I know she died she died in the beginning of 2015 and it, it, it did something to me it really did something to me it's like oh my god but I just want to just just tell her though she cannot hear me but I just want to tell her thank her because she was my first listener when I did the Inspiration of Prayer Network and she, Mother Margaret will always coast me on no matter what the circumstances look like she will always tell me I love I love to hear what you I love to hear you uh, pray keep on keeping on and although Mother Margaret is going on to be with the Lord I wanted to dedicate this show to her and just say I love you mother and I pray that I will see you in heaven once again this is the last show for 2015 I love you all be blessed Shalom and Happy New Year's